Hi, my name's Brady. I'm a physical therapist at Orthopedic Rehab Specialist in Holt. And I'm gonna to talk to you today about blood flow restriction therapy or BFR. BFR is the brief occlusion or restriction of blood flow into the lower or upper extremity. What this allows us to do as rehab professionals is progress patients a lot faster. We are often under pressure from doctors, insurance companies to get our patients in and out of the door faster, get them stronger, quicker, and back to function. BFR allows us to bridge that gap between low load resistance training and high interval intensity training. By doing this, we are able to get our patients out the door faster, get them back to what they are doing. Oftentimes, as rehab professionals, we are under the assumption that using light resistance bands and lower level dumbbells increase strength in our patients, which they do, but we have to take those muscles to failure, and taking those muscles to failure to see that change in strength can lead to more injury to the tissue. With BFR, we're able to take those same light loads, not take the muscle to failure, and see those same strength changes even faster, uh, up to two to three times faster than we would traditionally with what people think of as normal rehab. So to set up BFR, blood flow restriction therapy, initially we would find limb occlusion pressure where we would inflate the cuff to 100%, finding when the pulse stops, knowing that for this specific patient, that is 100%. When working out the lower extremity, we use 80%. So we'll pump this cuff up to whatever 80% of their limb occlusion pressure is. When we get that number, we can disconnect the pump. We'll bend this leg here. And all this patient's going to do is perform a straight leg raise. You're just gonna raise your leg up, a one, two, hold, one, two, down. Tempo is very important with BFR. And you're gonna perform 30 reps of this. Now. With BFR, again, low load exercise, but it's increasing strength a lot faster than we traditionally would with someone just doing a straight leg raise without the cuff on. There are numerous types of patients that can benefit from BFR. That we typically use it with post-op or even pre-op patients to build that strength up faster before or after surgery when we have atrophy in the quad or up in, in the upper extremity. But we can also use it for deconditioned patients to help improve cardiovascular activity. We can use it for those who have been bedridden and just want to get some movement and help build up the strength. Uh, we can even use it for recovery. Uh, after someone does a very heavy intensive, intensive workout, we can put the cuff on, do some light weight, and still get that same metabolic effect that we are looking for with exercising.